Good afternoon. I've been asked to say a few words about voice. I'm new to voice in a formal sense and there only for about a year. But I know about voice and I know that it is celebrating its 40th anniversary. It is remarkable because it reminds me of a concept in literature. The concept is called classical unity. In literature, classical unity refers to the coincidence of time, space and action. In a similar way, if we consider voice with respect to the consumer movement in India, there is such a coincidence that uh, the movement itself is almost as old as voice. Voice has lent a lot to the development of the consumer movement. And the third dimension is that Professor Sriram Khanna, who has been the doyen, who has been the founder of this organization, has in a sense also been a founder of the movement itself. So this is classical, this is a classical unity of sort. Having said that, as far as my contribution to voice is concerned, uh, I have tried to lend a new perspective to voice in terms of sustainability. Sustainability could be seen in three ways, environmental sustainability, financial sustainability, and business sustainability. And I think this uh, perspective, which has been adopted now by Voice, has helped it to get on to a different trajectory. And I would say that this whole journey of 40 years is very well deserved and it needs to be well documented and recognized in the history of consumer movements in India or in any other country as well because uh, voice has contributed at the international level also. All the best to voice as an organization and my respects to Professor Sriram Kanna who has led this body and has created a wonderful institution and all the best